Right. What intake grate for CHOP is available for the 2022-300 CDUs? How much top end will you lose to be hooked up? I would lose I, – I, I would rather be hooked up and have and be better planted than have top speed. Now, I know this guy's going 86 on the, on, on the ST3 hulls, and I could care less about going 86 on glass as opposed to always having the pump engaged in chop, personally. Because I encounter more chop than I do glass. I encounter more wakes from other boats than unmolested glass. I ride with groups, and I'll tell you what, the ST3 hull in a group of five people is unnavigationable. It's unpredictable. It wanders. It gets pushed out of shape. It rolls outside of the leading edge of the fantail and it goes all over the damn place. And you're like, dude, I can't, I can't take this. I can't, I can't. All right. So see, or Riva racing has an intake grade for the ST three hull. It's not the race one. There is a race one that they give to some racers for whatever reason, they do not sell it. Actually, I know the reason, and I've talked about it before. The reason is it scrubs two miles an hour, two to three miles an hour off the top end. But here's the difference. You're out in the ocean, you ain't going 86. You're not on glass. You need to keep that damn thing consistent and not popping out of the water. So the intake rate is what's going to make that big difference. You get the blades down to four or five, and you have that big gnarly snow shovel intake rate and yeah, I'm going 81, 82, but I'm consistent. I'm not surging. There's a difference. And it's important that you know the difference. The race grate that Riva doesn't sell because it scrubs two miles an hour, three miles an hour off the top end is the intake grate that I would buy tomorrow for that GTX outside. Okay? It would be. Hands down. I wouldn't waste, a I wouldn't waste any time I would get the race grate. Here's the thing. You want to get Riva to sell that damn thing? You scream at them. Give me the damn one that the racers are using. I don't care that I lose three miles an hour. I want to stay hooked up because I ride in rough water. Give me that one. Oh, we don't we don't know what you're talking about, Joe Blow. Joe Blow, you're crazy. There, yes, there is one. The racers have one. Some racers do. Some don't. But there is an intake rate that they have that's not sold to the general public that will glue you to the ceiling. Hey guys, thanks for hanging out. This clip was taken from our weekly podcast that we record here every Sunday night at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you want to watch the whole video, you can go to the Watercraft Journal's YouTube channel, go to playlists, and then click on live sessions. You're going to see it there. Otherwise, go ahead and leave a like, a comment, and definitely subscribe to the channel. It helps us grow. And again, thanks again for watching our videos, and we hope to see you soon.